Aloha, my name is Dr. Stephanie Hahn, and today's writing tip is about people's fears that whatever they're going to write about is going to piss somebody off. A lot of women write and the big person that they worry about offending is their mother, or they worry that they're going to get in trouble for writing something. You're always going to get in trouble for writing something. In fact, if you don't get in trouble for writing something, you're probably not writing anything that's particularly interesting. Your job as a writer is not to stay in the lines. Your job as a writer is to be curious, to ask, to disrupt, and yes, in this way, to love on a larger level in terms of looking at the global questions of why we're here and what we're here and what's it all about. And you only can do that if you dare to potentially make someone mad, piss them off, ruffle some feathers. It's art. The nature of art is rebellion. If you're not willing to rebel, uh, maybe you, you got to do something else, right? So uh, my suggestion is just write whatever it is you feel like writing and um, think about it. And if you're gonna piss somebody off, you know, deal with it. Decide that maybe um, you can talk to the person, decide that maybe it's, it's not really worth it after all to, to uh, you know, put it out there, decide you're gonna change the character. Um, there's a lot of things that you can do, but you definitely don't keep everything inside because keeping everything inside will not make interesting art, okay? So don't start criticizing yourself and shutting yourself down before you even get it on the page. And remember the nature of who we are as writers is rooted in an idea of disruption, okay? That's it for today. Um, please subscribe to my Substack newsletter at drstephaniehahn.com and hit this button on YouTube and I'll be giving you reading, writing and literature tips and talk about creativity and wellness and yeah, I just got out of the water and yeah, hop in the water, take a hike, do something like that. It'll be good for you. Cheers. Aloha.